I looked. They helped me look. How hard did you look? I think we've lost her, Doctor. No, 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 no. We just don't know where she is. Not the same thing at all. Come on. I'll tell you about the Lusitania later. Oh, keep an eye out for Bill. You have to move again. Stay in the sunlight. It burns off the slime. Yeah. Thanks. No problem. Are you hungry? Come on, you have to eat. How much food have we got left? Enough. Really? Shut up, Cornelius. Go on, eat it. It's two days you haven't had anything. I've never been lost this long. I need to find him. Who? The doctor. My friend. I don't know what I'm gonna do if I can't find him. Well, we will look after you. I'm gonna have to find my way home somehow. This is the safest place to be. The beast is still out there. You came back. Did you know what was in there? The gate. A portal between dimensions. Do you know what's on the other side? Uh, you don't know anything, do you? You just stand around making speeches and waving a TV arrow about. Shall I tell you what's in there? No. It's called the Eater of Light, and we held it back. Every generation, a new warrior went into the gate and fought the Eater of Light so it couldn't break through. But the creature did break through. It broke through, and it destroyed the whole Ninth Legion. It's weak. It's nearly dead. It will die soon. Well, let's hope so, because there are millions more just like it on the other side. And very soon, all of them will find their way through to this dimension. Then I'll hold them back. You'll hold them back? What? Your lollipop and your kitty face paint and your crazy novelty monster killing tool. Are you holding that thing right up? I don't want your help. But I'm all you've got. Believe me, I'm on your side. Ah! Come on, let's go. We're all in this together. We're gonna be fine. Marcus was hurt like you, and the sunlight healed him in the end. I am feeling better. Good. Yeah, don't worry, Bill. Lucius will look after you. Shut up, Cornelius. Ah, uh, Lucius, um, right, yeah, listen, there's, um, something I should explain. What? This is probably just a really difficult idea. I don't like men that way. What, not ever? Nah, not ever. Only women. Oh, all right, yeah, I've got it. You like Vitus, then? What? He only likes men. Some men. Better looking men than you, Lucius. I, I don't think it's narrow minded. I think it's fine. You know what you like. And you like both? I'm just ordinary, you know, like men and women. <laughs> well, isn't this all very modern? Hey, not everyone has to be modern. I think it's really sweet that you're so restricted. Cheers. We can be friends, though. Yeah, it did save your life. That means we're friends forever. <laughs> yeah, but I can deal with that. Why is it going dark? The sun's setting. No, it's the beast. It's circling us. It's looking for a way in. It's getting stronger again. Strong enough to feed. Every hour of sunlight that feeds it makes the world darker. Beast stronger. We've got very little time. I have to stop it. This is my fault. I'm the keeper of the gate. I have to put this right. So, you were supposed to guard the gate while everyone else went off to war. But you had strangers at the door and a guard dog in the attic. So, you let the beast come through. It was the only thing that would defeat them. So, you thought the Eater of Light could destroy a whole Roman army? It did. And a whole Roman army could weaken or kill the beast? Yes. Well, it didn't work. You got a whole Roman legion slaughtered, and you made the deadliest creature on this planet very, very cross indeed. To protect a muddy little hillside, you doomed your whole world. <laughs>